Hey buddies, let's have a look at John Mayer moving on and getting over. Okay, so that was the intro. So what I'm playing there is I'm starting on an E chord. Well, let's just take the notes because you can play it as single notes or chords. So let's start with single notes. Okay, so I'm saying G sharp, C sharp, 13, 14, B, 12, G sharp again, 13, E on 12, on the D string, A, 14, G sharp on 13, so, then I'm playing, got a hammer to the F, then an E, so, hammering to 11, E, and then last note's a C sharp, which is where the chord comes in, the F sharp minor seven. Okay, so Okay. Now if you want to flesh that out a bit, it's quite nice to play the chords. So what I'm playing there is E uh, on 9, B, E, G sharp, moving that up to an A major 7, E, G sharp and C sharp, 14, 13, 14, then playing an E chord, 14, 13, and 12, E, G sharp, B, so, then back to that G, e, e chord, D, E, G sharp, then just play another E chord, but in a different position, down here, G sharp, B, and E, 6, 4, 5, sliding that up to an A chord, C sharp, E, and A, 11, 9, 10. Back to the first chord, the E chord, 9, 9, 9. And then I... And then I just... From that, just... Kind of play the B as well, and the E. Hammer to the F sharp. And then... Then I play the F sharp minor. Or if you've got two guitars, just play a C sharp on 11. So slowly. See? Now, now the chords are F sharp minor, B7. And over that, for the intro, we've got a little solo. And it's all based around... Um, think of it as E major pentatonic. So, um, so the notes we've got, say we start at B, B, C sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, uh, uh, B, C sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, B, C sharp, E, carrying on up, F sharp, G sharp. And we can also add an A natural in there as well. Okay. Um, that works over these chords. Okay. So, using those though. So that's the first lick. B, C sharp, E, F sharp, 
slide it up to G sharp. So seven nine seven nine slide to eleven. Back to E sharp. Back to E. Sorry, E. Then the G sharp again. Then finish on F sharp. The next one. is hammer from a B and A to a B seven to nine on the D string and then play B C sharp E F sharp and I, I, I like to play that as a slide Then hammer to the F sharp again and finish on an E. So 7, 9, 9, 11, 9, 11, hammer to 11, finish on 9. So. Then. Then I'm playing G sharp, B, a C sharp, so I'm playing 13, 12, 14, a, a semitone bend up and down, and finish it on B. So, finish on 12. And then, uh, just to finish off, down here I'm hammering from B to C sharp then playing E so two four two then sliding up to six G sharp then play the B then going back down G sharp F sharp E finishing on F sharp So I'll play the chords again so you, you get an idea. That kind of thing. Okay, so for the song itself, um, the chords continue with the F sharp minor to B three times. So what we got there is the intro again, uh, playing out the same. Except instead of playing, I'm just playing the E again down here. So. So that is um, an A major 7, but I like to play it up the neck. So I'm playing 12, 14, 13, 14. And over that we've got... So over that A major 7, this is little lick. So I'm playing a slide up and down from 9 and 9, B and E on the D and G strings. So slide it up to 11 and back down to 9. 
but they do the same on the next two strings down. So I've got E and, e and B. Slide it up and down again. So I've got, so I'm sliding up to G sharp and C sharp and back down to E and B. And then just hammer twice from the F sharp. So I've got F sharp, so F sharp and B, sorry. So F, so G sharp and C, F sharp and B. Then hammer from the F sharp to the G sharp twice. The second time we go to that A major 7, it's a slightly different lick. Almost the same. So I'm just sliding from F sharp to G sharp. Then sliding from B and E up to C sharp and F sharp. So 9 and 9 to 11 and 11. And then G sharp, back to F sharp. Okay, so... Um, okay, so that's a um, slight variation. Now when we go back to the second verse, we play the same chords, F sharp, minor 7, B7, but we can add this little funky lick in. So I'm playing there, I'm just sliding up one semitone to the top three notes of the F sharp minor chord. So I'm sliding from 1, 2, to 2, 2, 2. And then I'm playing, adding a G sharp and back to an F. And then sliding from that up to a B6. So I've got B, D sharp, G sharp. And then putting it, and then playing F sharp on seven. And then sliding back to that. B6 and adding a B on top and then going back and repeating. Now there's also a couple of licks you can play over those chords. Those chords, so um, I could play this. So, so I'm just playing B, C sharp, E, then F sharp, so 2, 4, 2, then 4, 6, 4, F sharp, G sharp, B, and then B, C sharp, E. Okay, and then the other one is uh, it's that one. So F sharp to G sharp, nine to eleven, then to then to B on nine, then B B C sharp E. And then bend it to a, a G sharp, release it to an F sharp, land it, go to an E on nine, C sharp. Okay, so there's a couple of licks you can play over those chords. And then we've got um, uh, that section again. And then we go to a bridge, and the chords for the bridge are C sharp minor 7 for one bar, E for a bar, C sharp minor 7 for a bar, E for a bar. Then we've got a 
Okay, so for those chords, uh, C sharp E, C, C sharp minor seven E, C sharp minor seven E, then A, C sharp minor B E A, A C sharp minor B, B again, but I'm playing it up the neck on seven, and then finishing on C sharp major. Okay, um, so but over those chords, it's nice to play the little ar a little arpeggio over the C sharp minor to E section. And then that lick to finish off. So, um, what I'm playing now is just G sharp, B, F sharp, then G sharp, B, E. Okay, so, so. 11, 9, 11, 11, 9, 9. And then over those chords, A, C sharp minor, B, E, it's nice to play it like this. So I'm playing A and C sharp, 7 and 6, then C sharp and E. 11 and 9 then B and D sharp then G sharp and B um, 4 and uh, 6 and 4 then back to 7 and 6 A and C sharp and then Okay, so I'm playing A, A and C sharp, C sharp and E, B and D sharp again, so 7, five, seven 6, 11, 9, 9, 8, then 13, 11. C sharp and F sharp, then C sharp and F natural, which is where we go to the C sharp major chord. So let's check out this lick that's played over the C sharp major chord. Okay, and so what I'm playing there is C sharp and F natural. Then a G sharp, so 11, 10, 9, D sharp on the top string, C sharp, so 11, 9, then 11, 9 again on the B string, A sharp, G sharp, then F sharp, then E natural, C sharp, so I'm just going all the way down, 9, um, 11, 9. So, D sharp, C sharp, A sharp, G sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, B, finish on G sharp, 11 on the A string. So slowly. Now there's a harmony that plays over that. So what I'm playing now is starting here on an F on 15 on the D string, then G sharp, 13 on the G string, B, 12, B string, and F sharp, 
14. E, 12. C sharp, 14. B, 12. Then shift position down to G sharp. 9. F sharp, 11. E, 9. C sharp on 11. Finish on B on 9. Now what I've done is I've put the lick on a looper. So uh, I, and I put the bottom harmony on and so we can play over the top of it. See? How it sounds cool together. Okay, so that's that little harmony lick. Now once we've played that C sharp major lick, We've got four bars of F sharp minor. A little break kind of thing. And over that, the guitar can play uh, this little muted funky pattern. Okay, so what I'm playing there is F sharp, E, C sharp E um, 11 9 11 9 then F sharp E C sharp B 11 9 11 9 but going down and I'm muting that with my palm And then, at the end of those four bars of F sharp minor, a stab on a B. And then for the rest of the song, we're into just... F sharp minor to B, B7. And we've got to, some soloing over that until we fade out. So if you want to like, add some soloing, um, we can do that along the notes we looked at earlier. So I'm mainly I'm playing around two positions here. B, C sharp, E, F sharp, G sharp, B, C sharp, E. 9, 11, 9, 11, 9, 12, 9, 12. And then this little box pattern here. G sharp, B, C sharp, E, F sharp, and of course bending up to G sharp. So let me put the loop on and you can hear how that sounds. Kind of thing. Okay, so it's a nice chance to play those nice bluesy licks. Um, so a couple of nice ones in there is, of course, what's nice is to bend up to a, a G sharp, and then it's very Stevie Lucas for this. Add the note above it, which gives us an A. So we can play those nice. So adding that A into the mix gives us a little more variety. So that kind of thing. So just bending from F sharp to G sharp, then playing a semitone higher to give us that A note. Okay, and, and we can play it down here as well. That familiar lick. That one. So 
So Okay. So I'm playing bending from F sharp to G sharp. Then again adding a, a note, a semitone above. Then playing a B natural on 12. Bend it back up, then landed on the E. It's a familiar kind of bluesy lick. Sounds great over this kind of stuff. So yeah, you can have. how those notes work over those chords and repeat to fade so enjoy moving on and get it over thank you <laughs> 